Hi, this is Ty at Pier 33. It's Monday afternoon, August 27th. We've got a friend that we've been talking to on the phone for the last day or two regarding this Boston Whaler. He's a little way, ways away, so we're going to take it for a quick spin and a demonstration so that he can get an idea of how nice a boat this little 18 Whaler Outrage is. So I'm going to give you a look at the bottom before we splash it. Just a little bit of trailer rash there on the keel. Nothing terrible at all. Trailer rash or beach rash, actually. There's your hull sides and bottom. I'm going to look out from the side in just a second. Okay, a little bit of choke and three clicks to start. And this Yamaha 150 V6 is idling nicely. Battery switch, oil reservoir, dual batteries. And we'll switch on some things as we go here. Nice Garmin 53DV that was added just a season or two ago. There is an older hour meter on here. I believe Doug had asked me about that. Well, our knowledge is that there's nothing accurate about that for whatever reasons. There's a digital depth finder. There's the fuel gauge on that side. Let's get you zoomed out. You can see it a little better tack and trim gauge on this side, nearly brand new shifter shore radio underneath, bring the shifter back to a dead idle, sound and smooth. I'm going to shove off from the dock, I'll be back online here once we're ready to run. Getting ready to idle out of our channel here. By this Garmin GPS and sounder. Okay, I'm just about to the mouth of our channel. Once I pass that no wake marker, we'll be able to come right up on plane. drive trimmed all the way in. Right now idling at about a thousand RPM. We're going to be going right up into the wind so as I come up I'm going to lay the camera down so be ready. All right here we go. at about 26 miles an hour going up river right now.
40 all the way back down the river. Okay, back from our boat ride, we're still sitting there idling. That was a nice and uneventful, very short cruise. This will give you a little bit of a look at the upholstery on the boat in nice condition. Leaning post with a removable backrest. You can dress your teak in whatever way you'd like. different accessories at the helm. I believe this anchor and line and chain was left out of the locker when the boat was scrubbed down but those come with. You've got the original upholstery for those front benches as well as for the cooler top and backrests. That's not easy to keep around. That's kind of nice. Uh, the bimini top lays forward when not in use. Overall, it was a pretty good run. So there you go.